Assalamu alaikum guys. Today in this practical video, I will show you the big mistakes in the construction of footing for four story commercial building, ground floor plus three story. And I know you will never see this kind of mistake for commercial building. So let's get started guys. You can see this is RCC footing design. So the size is one by one meter. Depth is 1.5 meter. They will build four story building on this footing. So what do you think about this? Actually, the people which are making construction of commercial building, they don't know what is steel structure design. What should be the size? What should be the correct size of footing? Its depth, its steel reinforcement, etc. They just start construction and they don't know what will happen in the future. So guys, you can see the size is one by one meter. But here, if you see the depth is about uh, one point two meter here, but that one is one point five meter and they will build ground floor plus three other story. So this is four story commercial building. Now, guys, you can see they will use here strip footing. So for strip footing, they also uh, did the excavation, which depth is about two feet and width is also two feet. You can see guys. I don't know why they are wasting their time as well as they are wasting their money. Guys, you can see clearly. This is commercial building. On the other side, you can see they already built, especially its, its footing and also they did uh, a stone masonry. If you see its column, so now you will know very well about their construction. Six steel rods dia is 12 millimeter and it's uh, looking under gauge. Look at here. So this is not proper 12 millimeter. Six steel rods and they are building four story building on this. If you see its stirrup, which is 6 mm, you can see the hooks, hooks are bent with 90 degrees. So everything is wrong. So if you see the spacing of lateral ties, which is more than 12 inches or 30 centimeter, everything is wrong, guys. Look at here. Look. So about 12 inches, they, they kept its spacing of lateral ties. And if you see the size here, So the size of this uh, column is uh, 12 by 12 inches or 30 by 30 centimeter. They used just six steel rods. Guys, everything is wrong. So therefore, why I'm showing these kind of mistakes? Because if you are working on construction site or if you are a civil engineering student, so you should remember these things, which I'm discussing the front of you in practical videos. On the top of this, they will provide uh, the plinth beam. Now, guys, you can see here from the ground level, the plinth level depth is about 4.5 feet. Look, guys, they already did the construction of this footing. Uh, this column size is 12 by 12 inches. And these are at steel reinforcement longitudinal bars lateral tie spacing is 12 inches wow they will build four story building on the top of this i don't know who's doing the supervision of this kind of project and uh, maybe they don't have uh, a supervisor on construction site this is just the work of contractor if you don't know about the construction work and you give the construction on contract, so you will see these kind of mistakes, this kind of construction, and you will never see in the future. And maybe you did not see this kind of footing column for four story building. And I did already many videos that the size of the footing for G plus one story, for two story, you can say. So it should not be less than for two story, one by one meter or four by four feet. The size of the footing should not be less than this. 
and the depth should be also from 1.25 to our 1.2 to 1.5 meter so this footing which they did already so this is just for g plus one story ground floor plus one story so for two story they can use this kind of footing uh, uh, especially for domestic building also not for the commercial building actually these people are just making the fun of construction if someone don't know about the construction structure engineer and uh, uh, about uh, uh, steps of construction so they will face more problems in the future now i don't know when they will start at steel reinforcement so maybe they will not put any uh, steel mesh at the bottom maybe they will just put the concrete because uh, this is also my experience that uh, they are doing this kind of construction for four stories so what they will do after this because this is the foundation so foundation is the main part of building so if the foundation is weak so the structure will be weak as you can see clearly guys so hope this kind of video can help you when you see the size its depth and i am trying to show you if someone do this kind of construction so what happened in the future so i will show you also the situation of those buildings i will show you the cracks settlement uh, different uh, failures in building thank you